This is Osprey I at MikeChartCoach.com, and we are looking at ticker symbol VRNG. Okay, this is the second VRNG video today, and I wanted to show you here the the chart that we put out. This is uh, Eastern 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you look at the right up here, um, we, we're on the West Coast, so for us at Friday, the 30th at, at 7:02 a.m. or yeah, 7:02 a.m. Friday morning. Um, this chart was created and and, and then uh, posted on the site here. And as you can see, VRNG was up 3.32 percent at that time. And an alert came out. If you look here, that that the bullish homing pigeon reversal pattern formed yesterday was in the process of of uh, possibly being confirmed today. So I gave the alert out. And then I, I pointed out here the, the EMA's uh, 4 and 8 resistance line and, and stated that th there was this falling wedge pattern and a break above this, this, re th this resistance line, which the top of it was EMA 8 at 33, would signal more upside potential and would put the middle Bollinger Band at 36 on deck. So, uh, yeah, this, this alert was put out to our followers, um, you know, a, a half hour after, after the opening. As you can see, there was only 86,000 shares traded at the time. Um, you had Fasto down here below 20. RSI was just, like, coming up above the 30 oversold line. And then, um, you know, it, one of the things that caught my eye was that there was this first green volume, volume bar and reversal pattern that formed. So you had eight red volume bars in a row. And then a green volume bar, bar formed and a bullish reversal pattern. So that that you know caught my eye when I was scanning in the morning. And I was like, okay, got to post this chart for everybody. There could be confirmation. Um, and then if you see here, MACD was pinched and um, looked like it could be setting up for you know potential uh, bullish crossover. So yeah, I put the alert out to everybody, and then I uh, posted some TA here. Some technical analysis, you know, as you can see here, um, you know, the chart got posted on the website at 7:12. You know, it was created at 7:02, and then, um, you know, I, I let everyone know that this was a bullish homing pigeon reversal pattern. You know, I stated what was on the chart. I gave them a link here over to this this website, which which would give you the definition of the bullish homing pigeon. Um, always be sure to look down here at the uh, buy stop loss levels when I post a link to this page. This will tell you the confirmation level. Down here, the um, confirmation level is defined, defined as the last close, the mid midpoint of the last close of the previous candle. So, um, yeah. So, so then, <clears throat> this is how this is how it works on our website. And um, yeah, so I gave everybody the heads up. I gave them some information about the stock, gave them the TA. I let them know where support and resistance was. And then this is the this is the follow through. So you can see here where VRNG ended up closing um, up 28%, right, for the day at the close on Friday. And then there ended up being 1,683,000 shares traded. Now remember when I posted this chart, there was there were only eighty six thousand shares posted, right? Or not posted, but traded. There was eighty six thousand shares traded, and then you look here, you know, it closed with with one point six, uh, you know, one point six million, um, or you know, one million six hundred thousand more shares traded after that. So you know, the volume really picked up. You know, people got got into the trade. Um, you know the 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 other traders obviously saw the the bullish reversal confirmation, and um, you ended up closing with the MACD um, bullish crossover. As you can see, the the MACD crossed over. You know you had an increasing uh, volume from the day before, so you had two green volume bars in a row. You ended up um, breaking this red um, descending resistance line and EMA's four and eight, and then actually, as you can see here, I said that puts the middle Bollinger Band at 36 on deck. Well, you know, ended up closing above that level as well. If you remember on the previous chart, um, Fasto was at 14 when 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 I posted the the the, the chart, and RSI was at 30. Now you look over here. Now uh, Fasto closed in the bull zone between 50 and 80 and um, and RSI closed all the way up at 44 so when I posted it I mean it was still at oversold levels so this was a, a great alert 
you know, so it closed up 25% uh, from the 3% um, level that our, our, our followers got the heads up. So yeah, I just wanted to um, post this video to show you how, how it works on our website. You know, we come over, um, we have a chat, a chat up here for, for our followers and, um, you know, for our members. And um, I, we post the information on the chat as well. And, and that, that's really the spot where we post intraday information first. Um, we get, I post a lot of technical analysis. I, I, I always give, um, uh, um, you know, different thoughts to think about for the day. And um, I try to do, uh, you know, every day, um, post some strategy and some, um, you, know, in, you know, knowledge. Just try to try to share the knowledge on a daily basis, both technical and, and for trading. And uh, yeah, the chat is a great place where you can communicate with us during the, during the trading day and after the, before and after the market closes. So yeah, this is VRNG, and um, you know this is our this is our website, and this is uh, the the Osprey I board. So you go to the Osprey I board when you want to check us out and see the uh, see see all the great charts that we post throughout the day. All right, thank you very much for viewing this video, and um, I look forward to you, you giving us a try and checking out our website. Um, we do have a, a free 10-day trial. As you can see, these are uh, uh, charts that we that we post. These are all information that we put out daily. Um, yeah, just trying to give you the the best uh, uh, chart coaching that I can. I'm here to help. So I hope everyone's having a great. Halloween and everybody stay safe out there. All right. Take care.